Welcome to my channel. The Last Battle. Subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. On August 22, Russian President Vladimir Putin made the latest of several bold claims regarding the state of Russian military aviation at a meeting with representatives of the ruling United Russia Party. As for combat aviation, the whole world is well aware that we are the undisputed leaders in the field of combat aviation. Our combat vehicles are not only competitive, they are the best in the world. I say this without any exaggeration, but also with a sense of pride in our aviators and aircraft manufacturers," he said. Elaborating on the history of the relationship between civil and military aviation, Putin stated that since the Soviet era civil aviation was developed based on the needs for combat aviation, rather vice versa as was seen abroad, and that as a result often civil aircraft were military transport vehicles adapted for civilian purposes. He highlighted that this was the cause for historic difficulties in the Russian civil aviation industry, but claimed the situation had changed undoubtedly for the better, Russian civil aviation is becoming a part of world civil aviation. The president named the Sukhoi Superjet 100 as an example of a civilian aircraft that worked very effectively. These are the first machines that were entirely designed in digital form. This aircraft is actively used and will be used in the future. But this is not enough, and now we need a medium-range aircraft," Putin added. President Putin previously claimed that Russia's Su-57 was the best fighter jet in the world, although only one aircraft is known to be in service in the country's air force with 76 to be deployed by 2027. If you want to watch more interesting and educational videos subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon. Thank you.